So today I wanted to show you my mom's guinea pig cage. Um, it looks kind of similar to mine. It's a bit smaller. If you follow me on Instagram, you will have seen that I already posted pictures of one of my mom's guinea pigs, Domino's online, because I'm at home at the moment, and this is my mom's cage. So I'm going to get started. So up here, the guinea pigs have kind of cut a corner. They kind of started using the hay rack to jump on there. They have a little cuddle cup with um, polka dots on there and then a really, really thick fleece blanket. We already caught Domino sleeping upstairs on this blanket and like snuggling with it. Hey Domino, that is Domino. He's still really young. the same water bottle that I have, um, the Living World one with a carrot in there. And then they also have a little, like a little hidey place under the platform and they can, they all, can also use it as, as a house. And then their hay rack is right here. Right next to the hay rack is a little fleece tunnel and you can't really see her but Rosa is lying in there. And then they have a hay tunnel, the same one that I also have in my cage. And they have another fleece tunnel leading into the biggest guinea pig house ever. Seriously, this is, this house is huge. Right now there isn't a guinea pig sitting in there. If you look into that, it's huge, seriously. I think two rabbits fit in there. It's really huge, but it has these really, really cute um, windows. See, Domino is in here, so I can show you. Domino is still really small. Oh, look how much space he has in there. Hey, Domino, hey. Yeah, this house um, is huge. My mom ordered it online, and she didn't really check like how big it was. So um, it was kind of a surprise when it arrived in the mail because it's, it's, um, we use this fleece sack in there because the guinea pigs kind of didn't like it before probably because it's so big and open. These entrances are huge. So we put the fleece tunnel in one of the entrances so that the house is a bit darker and also that they feel a bit more secure and now they've started using it. And then the guinea pigs also have a little ball made out of wood and it has a bell in there and the funny thing is that Rosa really hates the sound whereas Domino always wants to play when he hears the sounds and, and he wants to chew on it and then the guinea pigs have their food bowls my mom I have the same one in blue um, I think there's only dirt in there that's one of their food bowls that's the one where they normally get their veggies in some spinach lying around do you want some spinach and then they have a second food bowl. My mom just puts like dried vegetables or like anything or like flowers, dried flowers, whatever. So anything that the guinea pigs really like to eat but can't really have in the winter because it doesn't really grow. That's kind of it for my mom's cage. <laughs>